Voguish design and luxury features at an entry-level price come together in the Mercedes-Benz CLA class. This luxury subcompact car shares its fundamentals and features with the more conventional class, but it wears more expressive styling. The original CLA class went on sale for a model year 2014, and the current second generation car arrived for 2020. For 2024, it receives a thorough refresh to remain competitive against small luxury cars, like the Acura Integra and BMW to Series Grand Coupe. Ports new. Mild hybrid integration promises improved performance and efficiency, updated front and rear fascia design, improved LED headlights, dual 10.3 inch displays now standard, lastest version of MBUX user interface installed, fresh paint, wheel, upholstery, and trim options, parking sensors and folding. Auto dimming side mirrors included, refined driver assist functionality. What we think. Talk about a second act, where the original CLA class was cheap feeling and unbecoming of a Mercedes badge. The current second generation model deserves its three-pointed star. It's a stylish little thing wearing the four-door coupe aesthetic innovated by the CLS class, not. All of its interior materials feel excellent, but the cabin delivers an upscale ambience. The CLAS impressive dual display infotainment contributes to that impression, but we haven't always found its MBUX software to be so intuitive. Hopefully the latest iteration added for 2024 is more user-friendly. For the most part, the CLA feels like a baby Mercedes. Its driving dynamics are satisfying and well integrated. The standard CLA to 5 is reasonably quick, but the CLA 3.5 and CLA 4.5S are nearly excessive in their acceleration. The firm, noisy ride we've observed might be forgivable in those AM models, but less so in the CLA to 5 That's one area where it falls short on luxury. Even so, the CLA is a stylish, enjoyable, desirable entry-level luxury car. We think it's one of the best options in the segment. Performance and MPGs. In the CLA to 50, a 2.0 litre turbocharged i4 equipped for 2024. It gains a 48 volt mild hybrid starter generator that makes engine start smoother and allows the engine to turn off. When the CLA is coasting, additionally, it can provide up to 13 horsepower for off-the-line acceleration. That's not factored into the CLA to 50s, 221 HP and 258 LBFD ratings, which are the same as last year. Even so, the mild hybrid system could improve the 6.3 second 060 mph time and to 4 to 5, 33 to 35 mpg city, highway ratings it achieved previously. The engine is connected to a 7-speed dual-clutch automatic transmission with FWD standard and AWD optional. CLA35 and CLA45S Entry Level OMG The CLA class provides a basis for the smallest and least expensive AM models. Those start with the CLA35, which uses a version of the CLA to 50s to 0.0 litre turbocharged i4, as would be expected from an AMG. Output rises to 300 to horsepower and 295 pounds FD of torque and a WD is standard. In our testing, the mechanically similar A35 launched from 0 to 60 miles per hour in 4.4 seconds. More power and insanity comes in the CLA45S. It also uses a 2.0 litre turbocharged i4, but it's the formidable M139, an entirely different engine than in its counterparts. 
it belts out 416 horsepower and 369 pounds FD of torque, all sent through an 8-speed dual-clutch transmission and AWD. We tested the less powerful non-SC LA45, hitting 60 miles per hour in just 3.6 seconds, so the 2024C LA45S should be properly quick. Safety features. This year, front and rear parking sensors, as well as auto dimming mirrors, become standard across the CLA range, front automatic emergency braking, and blind spot monitoring are essentially the only standard active safety features on the CLA. Choosing the driver assistance package adds features, like adaptive cruise control, front automatic emergency braking, and lane keep assist, which Mercedes says has been improved with smoother responses for 2024, semi-autonomous lane changing and parallel. Parking is available. Cargo space and interior room. Given its coupe-like profile, the CLA class isn't particularly roomy inside, it's a sacrifice you make for the sake of fashion. Technology. Gone are the 7.0 inch displays, previously seen on entry level C LA models for 2024. All grades come equipped with dual 10.3 inch displays, one functioning as the gauge cluster and the other the infotainment touchscreen. In addition to built in navigation and the latest MBUX user interface software, WIR ELESS Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are newly standard. There are USB C ports in both rows of seats, and all of the ports are now illuminated. A Burmester Premium sound system is available and now features Dolby Atmos technology for a more immersive listening experience. Is there an all-electric Mercedes CLA? Mercedes' all-electric ambitions are well known, with the flagship EQS sedan and SUV showing what the brand is capable of at the high end. But the entry level is at least as important. From a business perspective, what's Mercedes doing in that category? Models like the EQE and EQB present something of a starting point but the Concept C LA could indicate that Mercedes is aiming even lower. This design study clearly relates to the general shape of prior C LA models, but does so with a funky, futuristic, all-electric twist, shaped with aerodynamics in mind and packed with tech. The Concept C LA could hint at the next generation, C LA class likely to be as close a rival to the Tesla Model 3 that Mercedes has ever had. Pros and cons. Pros, sleek coupe-like styling, upgraded tech features, hooligan MG models, cons, some chintzy interior materials, few standard driver assist features, stiff suspension. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like.